Okay, now there we go. There we go. Okay. Let's try. Oh boy. Um, no, please. Let's turn that shit off. Press the swap. As you play, you fall in the robot, robot equip full abilities fall from the sky. Equip them with RB and use them with uh, Oops, uh, yeah. Yeah. Big Shoe. Hey. Ooh, that's that cute. Oh, nah. Oh. Uh-uh. Why is it opening up my web browser? Yo. How nice of them. Ah. Uh -huh.
Bruh. Oh, wow. So this is Doors of Giants. It's an, it's an adventure exploring rogue like rogue like maybe no, and it's really nice it's on uh it's currently in beta as you can clearly see they want everyone to test it and everyone who might be interested to play it so please do only thing I can really stay about it we're going to play one more level. Welcome to the Axial a sort of a hub blood. My name is Al. My psychic ability tell me that in the near future there will be an opening cutscene that will establish our relationship. But, since this is a beta, allow me to merely act as your Now, Frog. Sure. Your mission is to travel to various planets throughout our universe. That have been affected by the spur and restore them. Each time you restore them, you will grow your H E A T or H E T, which allows us to save more corrupted world. On your mission, you may collect various abilities, equipment, and experiences that you can use to improve your subsequent run. Some of which can do by changing your loadout here at the tree. Alas, we all have a role here at the Xbox, the hub world for your wow. To purchase weapons or armor, you can head to Babu, swap out cores and customize your look. Visit Panda and embark on missions. You'll head to Dr. Chameleon and his telescope. If you wish to upgrade any of your skills using the experience points you gain by completing missions, you'll come to me. I'll, I've gone ahead and unlocked your first skill upgrade. It's a short dodge you can activate. LB. Have fun. Oh, and do be warned. And do be warned. If you should have failed during the mission, all of your unspent XP will be lost, along with any accumulated heat. So, be sure to check back in with me to level up. Would you like to see the skill tree before you go? Ooh, we have skill trees. Three trees. Best frog friend. Increase your reload speed while playing as far as terminal. Probably boost. Uh -huh. Full clip! A. The first I reloaded. It really needs to sandwich. Drop the works. This is where I understand. Where are we? Just name it. Robot. Robot. Dog. Start to strike. You're gonna have to serve. Overflow. Just going to melee attack. Oh cool, I can, uh, I can, I can, I can, I can, I can, I can, I can. We're gonna... Uh. Quick 
Good afternoon. Let's fuck the fan. And this right here. Okay. Yo, what's good, Froggy? Germ? As always. You guys need to change your chords. How about you die? Huh? You don't know what cores are. Or dots. What's up? You feeling alright? All right, all right. I'm not big on explaining things. It just tires. It just tires me. Makes me sound stiff. But I got you. <laughs> Thanks, don't tell anyone about this. Mum's the word. Mum's. Cores are a technology. I'm still getting my head, my own head around. There's spheres of otherworldly ore that structurally change germs to robot body. I see. So basically, cores are your starting ability. And when you begin a mission, you start with two active and one passive ability based on your core. Sounds powerful. Very. When Germ first appeared, they had an extra, they had a health collector core. It's a passive skill that grants extra health whenever they collect energy. And the passive abilities? The starting abilities are a Germ dash and a stun for you, Frog. Awesome. You can see which core you have equipped in the pause menu. And when you can, collect cores by visiting planets and completing missions. Got it. You also get a new fit with each core, which you can use your dies to help. And I can help you with that new time. Good to know. Thanks. <sighs> Okay, let me see. Health collector. Okay. Baboon. 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 Damn, why, why, why are we going so fast? Oh, that's really on. Froggy, jerk. Impressive work out there. I haven't seen Marines with your skills since my days on fighting on Primaton X. Ooh. Oh. All in a day's work, ma'am. But you need to be more careful. Your arsenal is no joke. It's scant resources our operation has. It's vital that they are kept safe and secure. Is that understood? Yes, ma'am. Good. That's what I like to hear. Let's get out there and crush some empathy and entropy. Oh, let's crush some empathy. Okay. Let's revolve. Okay, let's go. We're going to try to do another level. Before we end it here, I really like this art style. Oh, look at that skybox. Ooh, that look good. Yeah, editing work. Can we get a... Can we get a, that look good? Thank you. That look good! That look good in there. Okay. Try not to get caught in the geometry. Stop! Could you please press that button to your right? Okay. Okay. Again. Slower this time. Oop. Slower. Boop. Too slow. Oop. Half it. Apologies for that, kids. 
Many years ago, I saw inside of a pulsating star and discovered an, in, an extra dimensional organic substance that is responsible for the function of the entire mammalian endocrine system. And it looked back at me. Anyway, I need to occasionally recalibrate my instrument around the inputs of those who have seen the eye of the new god. Make sure everything is in order. How can I help you? Where to? What is he? My job is to send you to various planets across the known universe. That said, I can only access certain planets once a certain heat limit has been met. Right. So what is it? Heat stands for Hyperspace Entropy Accumulation Trigger. Or alternatively, Harmonic Entropy Alternator. Tiffany. Frankly, none of us remembers what it exactly stands for. It has a nice ring, though. Don't you agree? Next. <laughs> Saving worlds. From entropy weakens their protection against our movement, letting us launch deeper into entropy space. We quantify this propensity for penetrating their perimeters as heat. Next. As heat rises, I'll be able to send you further, to, to further, more dangerous planets, among them, the ones Owl needs you to go and recover one of her boundary blade duties. Make sense? Mo so more heat means stronger enemies to fight means better reward. Yeah, got it. Oh. Let's select the world. Planet at the villa. Powerful the sequel. Planet of Evil. We'll go to the planet of Evil. Of Evil. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I am, 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 Um, what's up here? Oh, let's go. Thank you. 
Uh huh. That's what I'm with the container. Very nice, Eat that health ooh. Um Hey We shall Oh, okay. Got you a little got you a little humba, huh? Ah. Uh -uh. That's what's up. I really do enjoy some of the bloom effects on the on the line. Bruh. I didn't even get to read the description. Oh nah. Oh nah. Uh -huh. Hey, fuck you. Hey. Okay. Not so bad. Oh my god. It came from the doll. Oh no! Damn. All perks lost. Eat reset zero. Oh, that was fun. Need to get some. Um... Oh, I have one. Give me a. Okay, I'll stop. We obviously can. Um. Okay. That, that was pretty fun. That was pretty fun.